Hey guys, welcome to another video and today I am going to be speaking on a topic that has been really happening in the world. So, um, you know, 2020 has been a crazy year so far and making videos, gaming videos specifically, you know, gaming videos that are typically fun and funny, entertaining, it's hard to do when, you know, the world is dealing with a huge issue right now. And one that I really want to speak about on today is the Black Lives Matter movement. Um, I totally support it 100% as I am a colored person, but not preferably back black, but I am Mexican, or as you can say, Hispanic, Latino, whatever, whatever you guys describe me as. But, um... You know, it hits close to home because I can relate to some of the issues. And, um, you know, it really it really bothers me how this is still a problem in today's society. And as me being a young person in this generation, I feel like, you know, this this should be things should be different that, you know, slavery was banned approximately a long time ago, about 200 or 100 years and this is still going on here in 2020. It blows my mind because, you know, people think because of the color of your skin determines how you are as a person, determines your personality, what you do for a living. Not all the black people have no lives, uh, no jobs, nothing. They're just thugs, you know, supposedly. They're not. I know a few black people myself and I, you know, do not hate them. I do not judge them for the color of their skin as they that is nothing to control. And black people should be proud of their heritage and just as white people are. White people and all the races. So what I'm saying is, you know, this thing that's still going on in the world, I have been trying to sign petitions and trying to raise awareness, trying to donate you know, put the, put it on my Instagram. And, you know, I will put a lot of links in my description so you can go ahead and get more information. And I am collecting information as well from um, Netflix documentaries, um, series, and, you know, books. I would like to know a lot more because, you know, I don't know a lot of history. And I'm sorry if he's crying. He's kind of dealing with the crisis right now. Dogs too, yes. Uh, anyways, you know, I wanted to make a gaming video and I have already made one, but I felt as if, as if it's not in my place to, you know, be happy and pretend as if nothing's in the, nothing's happening in the world. And I would like to <laughs> What was that? And I would like to, you know, spread awareness on this topic and say that I hear you. I hear you guys. And, you know, and I wish nobody had to do, had to deal with this. And because black people are no different than us. We're, this is, there's just one race and that is you. Can you shut up, dude? He's not letting me make a video. If you want to be, oh, we gotta censor that, huh? If you wanna be here, then why don't you just say so? Okay. But, um, I probably won't be posting videos until next week, possibly. Um, I'm gonna hit it and still make content, but I am working on myself currently. As you know, I'm still dealing with trauma and issues deep-rooted problems like that alongside with what's happening in the world it's kind of hard and you know coronavirus is still around and you know protesters really don't care because i stand y'all i stand y'all i wish i could do that but <laughs> my parents will not let me will not let me take a step outside this house or they will freaking beat me up all right but um anyways 
I just want to say that through all this, everybody matters. You matter. Not the color of your skin. It doesn't matter based on the color of your skin. It doesn't matter on your race, religion, your views, your political opinions. It doesn't matter. Okay? I love you. I love you as a person. And many other people do. Many influencers love everybody. Every single, every single person in this world. Not anyone should not have to deal with this judgment. Everybody deserves happiness. They deserve to be accepted into the world. They deserve to be a person. They deserve to have rights. They deserve to be equal alongside privileged people. And you know, it's, it's not to take it too far and, you know, make white people repent for their privilege because they cannot control it of the color of their skin, too. There's, you know, white racists, there's white supremacists, and there's white people who completely stand with us. And which is why we shouldn't judge any people, including blacks, including including Hispanics, including Indians, including everybody in the world, every single race. No one should judge a person based on the color of their skin. And you know, it's not just the skin that makes me, that the people get judged for. Sometimes facial features, and you know, it really bugs me when people judge people based off their face features and assume you're a race. Because there is tons of races in this world. You can't assume a person's race and assume that's their only race because you don't know their parents, you don't know their history, you don't know anything. So please just call a person, every person a person. And you know, I hope I get my point across and I don't offend any people because, you know, sometimes I let my anger get to me and I blurt out words and sentences that, you know, can offend others. If I do, I apologize dearly and I hope I get my point across. And, you know, it just really bugs me how this is still happening in the world. And, um, you know... I'm sad with everything that's happened this year and we still have yet six more months to go. It just scares me because we don't know what's next. But for the meanwhile, I know I will I know I will fight for this movement. I will fight for equality and I will fight for all of you guys so we can all be happy. And there's not going to be just... You're so loud. I think the more I talk, the more he cries. Yeah, that proves my point. Don't have dogs, kids. Because this is what happens. Are you done? But, um... Yeah? Shut up, dude! But yeah, I have... I'm not gonna speak about political... <laughs> Stop! Dude! I'm not gonna speak about political views. Oh my freaking god! Boo boo! Shh! I'm not gonna speak on political views because, um, yeah, I don't want to get too pol political in this video here. But, um, all I really want to say is I stand with y'all. I stand with everybody. And if you say all lives matter, if you say that in my comments, <sighs> they matter, okay? All lives do matter. And I love all lives, okay? But there is a certain 
there is a certain issue here that only has to deal with one group of people, possibly more, because, you know, it's basically all people of color, if we interpret it that way. But we're focused mainly on blacks. And, you know, they haven't reached their level of equality that they want. And, you know, white privilege is a thing. It is a thing. Trust me. If I can ask a favor of pure white people to use their privilege and stand against these police officers and, you know, military commanders, whatever, whatever, who's ever on the street and say black lives matter. Say every single black person who has died due to police brutality, due to anything racism related, say their name. And I will leave their names in the description below and I will chant them because they deserve to have justice because George Floyd has sort of received his justice, his justice. The one who murdered him ha finally has a second degree murder charge and um, manslaughter as well. And the other three got accused as well, but I'm not sure which charges they have. But you know, it makes me mad how there was other people there and they didn't do anything to stop it. The police officers thought it was completely fine to, you know, let a man, let a man die in front of their eyes while a police officer was literally putting his knee on his neck. He wasn't resisting. He wasn't arrest, resisting arrest. He wasn't doing anything. And you know, it just angers me because I don't know why that happens. And you know, I wish things were different, but this is sadly the world that we live in. This is sadly America. And you know, I really, I really hope I can do something about it. Besides donating or maybe um, signing petitions. You know, I wish I could make laws. I wish I could change police rules, their, their regulations. I just want you to know that you guys will get your equality. I know. I know. Because, you know, it's soon to happen. It's soon to happen. And there is many people who stand with you alongside me. And, you know, I will do everything in my power to stop this mayhem. To stop everything. But even if we lose... We're still winning at heart, and that's what matters. They're gonna always be on the wrong, and we're always gonna be on the right. And if we got each other's back, there's no letting go. Anyways, I think that is all I've wanted to let go of my chest, but um, thank you guys for watching. It really means a lot, and you know, I wish I could go protest right now, but this coronavirus thing is still relevant, sadly, nowadays. And um, we have to all take precaution, but I'm pretty sure people, protesters, think it's must, much more important to do this movement, and I agree. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys got my point, and if I offended you, um, I'm sorry. I'm just very angry, and, you know, I'm young. I'm naive, I guess you could say, but you know, I feel the anger, I do. And I am sorry that you, everybody, I'm sorry that blacks have to deal with this. And I'm sorry that colored people still have issues to this day. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna end this video here. Thank you guys for watching. And I love y'all. Peace.